What is up guys? I'm Daddy Gamer Fred back again with another trailer reaction review. Today we're going to be taking a look at the Mewtwo Strikes Back's Evolution second trailer. Now this trailer is also a minute long which is sucks because I want to see more of this movie. I wanted a full length trailer but no they gave us another minute. Hopefully in this trailer we actually see more of the movie determine what exactly this movie is going to be because I think it's like a big mystery right now. We don't know where the, they want to take the direction of this movie is it just going to be a one for one remake is it going to be taking stuff like i choose you where it takes parts of the story from that first movie and kind of mix it and intertwines with other stories and other beats from the pokemon universe i hope it's the latter of the two but let's jump in check this trailer so i can jump back on twitter and my social feeds and put on my headphones i have to watch this and mewtwo strikes back evolution神秘の力を持ち大洪水を引き起こしたとか。あれに咲くもつを実らせ、人々に分け与えたとか。うわ、すごい、ね。別の生命を作り出せるのは神と人間だけだ。Definitely a remake of the original game. Come on. ここはどこだ誰が作ってくれと願ったこれはお前たちへの逆襲だ逆襲 Evolution. Relax, relax. Now, this is such a tease. It's like, it looks good. But Jesus Christ, it is such a tease. Oh my God. We get like one second shot of Mew flying around. We get Charizard, Blastoise, Venusaur inside of their clone chambers getting made. We get like a second of Ash, right? Walking into this thing, which looks like it's going to be a one for one beat of the fucking original movie, which is not a bad thing for me. I do hope they do take the liberties and spice it up, add some shit, you know, like Mega Evolutions or stuff that we got in previously after the first generation of Pokemon and shit like that. Yo, mute fucking, I'm gonna stop around. I'm gonna show you guys this. Charizard's neck is crazy in this shot. <laughs> oh God. And Mewtwo coming down. And then we get a close up of Misty with Togepi, Psyduck. Ash, Brock, and Nurse Joy. Besides Tokopi, I don't see any generation two or three Pokemon thrown into the mix. That's what I want to see. I want to see them be like, all right, you know, Lucario is in the movie as well. Like, you know what I'm saying? Not just be stagnated to the Pokemon that this movie came out with. Like, you could throw in Incineroar in this movie. It's okay. It's been done in the Pokemon I Choose You very well, and I think they could do it as well in this one. And I'm hoping that's the case, but from what we see now, it's we got Blastoise in the back and, you know, Little King and Golduck, all generations. Generation one Pokemon. Uh, Arch Style, it looks, it looks good. I like it. I don't have an issue with it. I kind of wish the games were more this art style, to be honest. Like the Meowth in the back looked better than anything we got, we seen video game wise. This actually kind of resembles with the fur on Meowth of what we would see in Detective Pikachu, which is gonna be probably the greatest movie of Pokemon. I don't wanna just say that without actually seeing the movie, but visually anyway, with it being live action and this, you know, being CGI, it does look cool. I give it that. And then we get the one second of Jessie with her, you know, 
hair. It's cool. It's cool. I want to see more. I want. I, I. I need to see more. Again, this didn't feel like a trailer. It felt like a one-minute tease. And hopefully, they show us more before this movie comes out to kind of, you know, not to say win us over. As fans, we're gonna watch this anyway. Um, I just hope that it's. It, it does get. A decent juicy trailer before release. Let me know your thoughts on the Mewtwo Strike Back Evolution trailer. As a score, a score, even though it was one minute, I would have to give it a two, which is probably the lowest scoring Pokemon trailer I ever did. And that is because while it's beautiful, it's kind of it's kind of hard to sc score this one because if it is a beat for beat remake of the original movie, we know what's gonna happen. So we don't need that spoiled for us, or we don't need a tease for us we know what's gonna happen but i do think there is a lot of people in this world who haven't seen the original movie that this should be aiming to try to get them in the seats to see and this doesn't look like it's doing that the size of Mew flying around if you had no clue who Mew was if you had no clue who Mewtwo was you probably not gonna see this movie and watching this trailer is not gonna change your mind i'm gonna leave it at that let me know your thoughts on this movie i'm hyped i'm gonna see it day one but it's like Please, please, please. Let's get that correct hype for this movie rolling. Like, drop a good, sustainable trailer that is gonna be like, people are gonna be like, oh shit, this is gonna be the movie to see. Right now, Detective Pikachu is still in that thunder for good reasons, and hopefully, in the year 2019, hopefully this kid punch hard as well. Especially with Sword and Shield coming out. I'm hyped for them games. I kind of wish Sword and Shield um, kind of looked like these movies, to be honest. But I'll say that for a different video. Peace. I love you guys. I'm going to see you guys on the next trailer reaction review. Like always, guys, I'm Daddy and my friend on Instagram and Twitter. And you guys can bring the conversation there. I'm the American gamer in Switzerland right here on YouTube. And yes, I'm going to be doing a ton of videos just like this one. So if you enjoy, please hit that subscribe button also hit the like button it does help me out a ton as far as growing the channel is concerned ring the bell if you want to be notified on the next time i drop a video peace i'm gonna see you guys on the next one